Hello, I'm Edward Tart, once a Catholic priest for five years in the 1960s, now an atheist, which means I find no credible evidence for the existence of any God. Today is June 25, 2013. In last Sunday's New York Times, the Freedom From Religion Foundation ran a quarter-page ad opposing the fact that the Boy Scouts of America do not allow atheist members. At the top of the ad was a cartoon drawn for the Freedom From Religion Foundation by Don Addis. The cartoon depicts a scout pointing to some of his merit badges and saying, This one's for swimming. This one's for woodcraft. This one's for religious bigotry. I will now quote or paraphrase what the ad says. Why is it socially acceptable to discriminate against atheists? We congratulate the Boy Scouts of America for lifting its long-standing hurtful ban against gay membership. But why hasn't the Boy Scouts of America stopped excluding non-religious boys also? Boy Scouts of America advertises, quote, any boy may join. Unquote. Yet it explicitly bans atheists, non believers, and youngsters from non religious homes. Boy Scouts of America proudly excludes and stigmatizes the one in three young persons today who now identifies as non religious. Source The Pew Survey, October 9, 2012. Boy Scouts of America's membership form contains a religious litmus test that defames free thinkers. It says, quote, The Boy Scouts of America maintain that no member can grow into the best kind of citizen without recognizing his obligation to God, unquote. We say... No one can grow into the best kind of citizen who discriminates against the non-religious. It's what you do, not what you believe, that makes you a good person and a good citizen. Boy Scouts of America's, quote, duty to God, unquote, has led it to cruelly place dogma over its duty to children. Religion makes claims for which there is no evidence. We need to reject such claims. Doing so is not only respectable, but vital to progress. What should not be respectable is treating any American, whether young or old, as a second-class citizen. That is quoting and paraphrasing the Freedom from Religion Foundation's ad. Now, consider four groups of people. Gay boys, gay men age 18 and over, atheist boys, and atheist men. Recently, the Boy Scouts of America voted to allow the first of these groups, gay boys, to be in their organization but they specifically excluded gay men as possible scout leaders, and they apparently did not even consider the matter of atheist boys and men. So, the Boy Scouts of America now says to a gay boy, okay, you can be a member. But on the day the gay scout becomes 18 years old, the Boy Scouts of America equivalently says to him, Get out of here, you pervert, and never darken our door again. And to atheist boys and men, Boy Scouts of America says, No, period. So the Boy Scouts of America has done one of four things that it needed to do. It has said that gay boys can be scouts. There are three more things it needs to do, and it needs to do them as soon as possible. Tomorrow would be just fine. Say that gay men can be scout leaders. 
that atheist boys can be scouts and that atheist men can be scout leaders. I am a member of the Freedom From Religion Foundation. I support it with money. At the bottom of their ad, they say, Join FFRF, educating about non-theism and keeping religion out of government. Phone 1-800-335-4021 for a free copy of our newspaper, Free Thought Today. Visit FFRF.org. To all of you, thank you for watching this video.